Hello and welcome to this video lesson on articles, specifically the articles A, N, and the. Articles are small but important words in the English language that help us to understand the specificity of the nouns they modify. A and N are known as indefinite articles, while the is known as a definite article. Let's start with A and N. These two articles are used to refer to a nonspecific or unspecified noun. A is used before a noun that begins with a consonant sound. To recall, there are 21 consonants in the English alphabet. These are B, C, D, F, G, H, J, K, L, M, N, P, Q, R, S, T, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Keep in mind that Y can sometimes function as a vowel, which is known as a semivowel. While N is used before a noun that begins with a vowel sound. In English, the vowels are A, E, I, O, and U. Although Y can sometimes count as a vowel too. For example, we say a cat and an apple. Let's use it in a sentence. I saw a cat outside. Can you pass me an apple, please? But wait, you may be asking, what about words like our or honor? They begin with a consonant sound, but we still use an before them. This is because the initial sound of the word is actually a vowel sound. So, we say an hour and an honor. Now let's move on to the, which is used to refer to a specific or previously mentioned noun. For example, if I say the book, I am referring to a particular book that we have previously mentioned or is known to both the speaker and listener. For example, the book on the table is mine. That can also be used to refer to something that is unique, like the sun or the moon. There are also some situations where we don't use an article at all. For example, we don't use an article when talking about things in general, like books are great. We also don't use an article when referring to uncountable nouns, like water or advice. So, to summarize, A and N are used before nonspecific nouns that begin with consonant and vowel sounds, respectively. The is used before specific or previously mentioned nouns. And in some cases, no article is used at all. I hope this video has been helpful in understanding the use of articles in English. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more.